Today, we're going to share with you the best geocaching videos of 2014. That's coming up next. Hey everybody, it is Joshua, the geocaching vlogger, and I'm here with a special guest today. It is Justin, the GC Doc, and we are here to bring you some of the best geocaching videos of 2014. I've done this two years in a row. I did it once in 2012, and then I did it last year, and so this year, we're gonna do it again. But I'm gonna do it a little bit different this time. We're gonna go through roughly four different categories of geocaching videos, and then you can go over to the GC Docs geocaching channel for part two so you can get the rest of the list there. All right, so this is how we're gonna do it this time. Instead of like ranking the videos like number one video, number two video, number three video, we're actually going to do different sorts of categories of geocaching videos. For the very first geocaching video, it is going to be categorized as the most evil geocaching video. <laughs> this video is actually called the most evil geocache yet, and it is by YouTuber Geopat92. Geopat92 has made my list the last two years, and this is three years in a row. Three Pete, baby! So in this video, it features an evil geocache. But here's the deal, there's all kinds of evil geocaching videos out there. The thing that sets this one apart is how Geopat92 put the whole video together. Justin, can you explain a little bit why you like this geocaching video? Sure, obviously, like Josh said, it's a very evil hide but it's how he filmed it, how his friends had no idea where it was. He was in, in on it the whole time, and he was being very devious and walking around, pointing out behind their backs where it was actually located, and they were <laughs> way off, obviously. Awesome, so enjoy a clip of this video, the most evil geocache yet. Hey guys, Geopat92 here, and I'm standing here with GeoKyle and GeoXander, and they are gonna find a really good geocache. They're, they're right at GZ right now. I actually found it the other day with Saramber and it's so good that we had to come back and film it. Let's see. It seems pretty easy. What does it say? Read it out loud. Seriously, you thought it was going to be that easy to keep it? <laughs> so where was that? Right up in here. Nice. Come up. This is stuck on here like this. So you take it off right when you get here. You open it, it says this isn't it. So you just put it back up there. Well, at one point, they even took this part down. This one doesn't come off. This one does. But you look at it, it's nothing. Throw it away there's no but you squeeze it, and inside there is the long. The next category of geocaching video is the best geocaching location. If you're a geocacher, you know this. You know the one of the things that's great about geocaching is that it takes you to incredible places. And YouTuber WV Hunter 1968 takes us to an earth cache called the Eternal Flame. And this location is a waterfall. And as you walk to the waterfall, you look a little closer and you see a burning flame behind the waterfall. It's like a little methane sort of leak. And it is incredible. Justin, what did you like about it? Yeah, I mean, you'll see how crazy, crazy this location is. But not only that, he brings his father along with to experience it, and they both are just in awe, as uh, you will be too. Family, friends, and flames. Watch that next. Hey guys, WV Cashers 3 here. We're gonna be heading to a very cool cache. It's called the Eternal Flame uh, Geocache. And it is right down the trail here. There's a waterfalls, and behind the waterfalls is a flame lit from some methane leakage coming out of it. And there it is, right there. Wow. There it is. Hey, that was awesome. I encourage you to check out WV Hunter 1968's YouTube channel because he has a ton of other amazing geocaching videos on there as well. All right, the next category of geocaching video is the best parody geocaching video. Geocaching with Derek made a video, and the, it was a geocaching video based on the 1980s movie Stand By Me. You know the one with River Phoenix and that dude from Star Trek, you know, from Star Trek Next Generation? Wesley Crusher? Oh, Will Wheaton. Will Wheaton. It's Will Wheaton. So he does a parody geocaching video of 
of the train scene, of when the train is almost hitting them, and he does a great job. Justin, do you have anything else to say about it? The cache is in the, in the exact location you'd expect it to be in that situation, and they do a good job putting it all together and making a very good uh, story and a very good film. Awesome. So enjoy this video by Geocaching with Derek. Stand by me, Geocaching. Hey guys, it's Derek. I'm out with Guitar Man 24 today, and we're going after a cache called Stand By Me. Do you remember that movie? That was one of my favorites back in the day. So. Find a geocache. Oh, nice. All right, and now for our next geocaching video category, and that is best geocaching event video. There were tons of great and amazing events all over the world this year, but I really enjoyed the video that featured Geo Woodstock 12 by none other than. GC Doc! Hey. <laughs> How about for that awkward pause? It was a great time, it was a great event, but I really loved how Justin put this video together. Justin, do you have anything to say about your own video? Uh, it was a lot of fun making it. Mm -hmm. It was more fun to go to the event. Yes. And it was more fun to hang out with this guy and see his craziness at these events. So it was actually my first mega. Awesome. Mm -hmm. So enjoy this video, Gia Woodstock 12 by none other than GC Doc. I just ran into Tweetness, another geocaching vlogger. John from Travel Fleas. We got Elliot here. Getting close. Okay. Geoday, everybody recognizes Geoday. All right, guys, there you have it. The links to the full videos are in the description below. So make sure you go there, check out those videos, and subscribe to those channels because they got a lot of other great videos behind those channels as well. And another thing you need to know is a lot of the video creators were from the Geocaching Network. If you don't know what the Geocaching Network is, there's a link for it in the description below, but there are like 40 plus geocaching vloggers on that channel sharing their geocaching adventures with you. All right, so that completes the first four categories. Now, you must go over to the GC Docs channel. I want you to click on his face, and when you click on his face, it'll magically take you to his video and his four categories, and who knows, maybe I'll be there too. And while you're over there, make sure you subscribe to the GC Doc because he's got awesome, family-friendly geocaching videos and he does a great job of them. If this is your first time watching the Geocaching Vlogger, make sure you click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our geocaching adventures as we attempt to bring joy to the world one geocaching video at a time. And as always, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.